Yes, today again, we're coming from Wentworth Ag between Winkler and Morden. If you want to come here and get a free burger, make sure you come quickly. Secondly, we got a bin that we're giving away. But today I'm talking to a farmer I've known for some time. In fact, I knew him in the other world when he was actually producing pigs. And now I think he's been out of that for some time. His name is Don Weed. Tells me he farms at Carmen. What brings you out? Oh, just um, support these guys. We've uh, bought a few bins and stuff from them. And... Uh, They've been good to us, and it's good to support them back, and uh, yeah, it's a good day for it. So, yeah. so you're going to be here till 2? I suppose we will, but yes. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, tell me a little bit about your farm. How's the crop looking? Uh, so far, the crop's been pretty good. We've had decent rain. I think so far we've had about 5 inches of rain since we seeded. So we've been just getting timely rains, which has been nice, and uh, the rain last night was, was good. Another 6 and a half tenths last night. And, uh, but the crop's looking good. Um, I think... The oats and the wheat's filling nice, and canola is just finishing off blooming, and uh, it was good. Any yeah. corn? No corn. No, yeah, no. That, that stuff is growing like crazy. Oh, it's unbelievable how much that stuff has grown. Like, yeah, phenomenal. It's uh, interesting to see. Uh, I know Jason Clausen. I've known him from on the ball field, the umpire, and of yeah. course he was a home run hitter like crazy. And uh, and but it's really good to see a young fella like that, and he's young compared to me and you, yeah. and uh, to do business. So obviously there's an attraction for you to come and do business here. Yeah, you betcha. I know we, we've uh, we put up several bins from these guys before, and they've been very good to us and treated us well. And uh, it's good to give them our business. So you miss the hog business? I you know I miss the chores. I really miss the chores. You know, getting up early, getting in the barn. Uh, that part I miss. You mean you sleep in now? I, well, what's sleeping yet? <laughs> Six <know>. o'clock? <laughs> Very good. But no, I, I enjoyed the chores, and I really miss it because ever since a kid, we always had chores, but not anymore. So, so who farms with you? Uh, my son, Brett. Uh, he's um, he just finished his ag diploma degree, and so uh, he's been farming now for a couple. This is his second year farming together, so uh, the farm will probably continue on uh, another generation, which is great. So, Did your dad turn it over to you? Yes, he did. And so you got plans to do the same with him? That's correct, yeah. Yeah, my dad farmed till about uh, three years ago. Four years ago, he finally, the last of his land that he was farming, he just said, oh, okay, I think I'm done now. And my dad is um, late 80s now. And so if I can, if I could farm and, and be as more active as he was up to that age, that'd be great. But uh, I don't know. Who knows how long? <laughs> Never good. know. Thank you very much. Oh, Don Weeb, uh, all the way here from Carmen, supporting Wentworth Ag at the Farmer Appreciation Day. And it's uh, absolutely great to see the people coming up as you look towards uh, the right of me. And uh, you'll see the, uh, the lineup of uh, farmers and other people coming in for the uh, Spence Burgers. And we'll be talking to the Spence people uh, a little bit from now. But... Uh, Great to see, as Jason said earlier, he's expecting, well, he doesn't know. Uh, the rain obviously helps, but two to 300 to 400 people coming here to show their appreciation. And it's not just that. It's uh, Wentworth Ag and all their suppliers showing their appreciation for, uh, for what the business uh, they've been giving. And as we've known before, 15 years ago is when this business, uh, or when Jason took over that business and... and uh, came right out of uh, wherever he was living and look at what we have today i'm always excited in having served agriculture for over 47 years to see businesses like this local people do great work and supply the farmers that feed the world so for now this is harry siemens for the farm show and siemenssays.com